Forty years after its opening, the National Air and Space Museum is in need of big repairs. And the Smithsonian says those repairs will cost hundreds of millions of dollars. Seven on your side, watchdog investigator Chris Pabst went to find out why. With seven million visitors last year, the National Air and Space Museum is the third most popular museum in the world. But that kind of traffic has led to much needed repairs. And the most recent estimate for that work has come in at $365 million. The Air and Space Museum is very important to the economic health of the institution. Claire Brown, the director of communications at the museum, couldn't talk about the estimate, since it's only an estimate. But she told Seven on Your Side the heating, air conditioning, and mechanical systems in the giant building are original and need to be replaced. So do the exterior marble panels, which are cracking and warping. This protective walkway, four of which were installed around the museum, are designed to protect pedestrians against anything that could be falling off the facade of the building. And get used to seeing these, construction is not supposed to begin until 2018, and it could last upwards of eight years. This estimate of $365 million for restoration compares to construction costs of $200 million for the Museum of the American Indian, built in 2004, and $390 million for the upcoming Museum of African American History and Culture. This building has been open, like I said, for 40 years. There are a lot of people here, um, but it's time to replace it. Chris Pabst, ABC 7 News.